Hey, what up everybody? This is Stevie Breach coming to you today. I am working on the road at my uh, secondary job who calls me every once in a while. I'm going to be working here uh, today. I'm going to be working here next week. And uh, that's going to be my mania money. Not everything, but it's going to be at least be enough to cover my uh, mania ticket that's going to be going on on sale. So, uh, rock on. Easy money. As I'm standing here, I look across the street and there's a store closing. A uh, big sale, a blockbuster video. Uh, so I head on over there on my lunch. Picked up a nice little bag to so show you off my uh, stuff. Somebody already uh, grabbed up all of the... Uh, uh, what the heck was it? The um, all the wrestling uh, movies—they're all gone. I couldn't find anything sports-related in there. No UFC stuff, no WWE stuff. So they either packed that up and sent it to another store, like they do all their newer, newer releases on movies. Um, but uh, I, I bought a, a good little haul of other ones. Um, I picked up this uh, popcorn seasoning, uh, nacho cheddar and uh, butter. They were 50 cents a pop. My wife really likes those. She used to work at Blockbuster. That's where I met her and picked her up at. <laughs> uh, first one is um, Family Guy, It's a Trap, one of the Star Wars movies. Uh, I'm not sure which one this is. I know I only have the first one, so I think this is the I think this is the third one, but I'm not 100% sure, but there's It's a Trap. Uh, Mike the Miz Mazarian. The Marine 3, I don't know how this is going to be, but I heard from a lot of people this might be the best uh, WDB movie that there is out there. So for $3.99, I picked that bad boy up. Got some Blu-rays for $3.99 as well. This one is uh, Journey 2, The Mysterious Island with The Rock. I got uh, The Campaign with uh, Zach Gilvanakis and Will Ferrell. Never seen this, but I remember the commercial. That seemed pretty funny. So check that out. I got Piranha Double D. Oh, well, three Double D is what that is. I've seen the first one, I liked it. I never saw the second one, but I saw the, remember the commercials for this one. Remember that it had Nick Nolte and um, what the hell is your name? David Hasselhoff. So I decided to give that a chance. Uh, this summer, we went to uh, a Marley and Me showing at a movie in the park. My kids really loved it, so I picked up Marley and Me on Blu-ray. And anybody who's wondering about these cases, how the, the thing looks so small, uh, what Blockbuster does on their sales, which is pretty cool, they give you the Blu-ray disc, and then they give you the original sleeve right there with this other blue background uh, thing there for you. So if you're uh, not paranoid about it, you can just put this on your shelf like it's a normal DVD, even though it's a Blu-ray, or you can go out and buy... Blu-ray cases and put those in there and it'll look just like anything else. Movie I didn't have yet, but I really liked. I went to go find this to watch it uh, not that long ago for my collection. I was surprised I didn't have it. But I got Funny People with um, Adam Sandler and uh, that other fool, Seth Rogen there for you. Can't go wrong with that. And then the last one I picked up was another rock movie, uh, Snitch. Um, I don't... I, I haven't seen a lot of rock movies. I don't know if it's because I felt like a he left us, and he left us hanging to go make some movies, and I took it out on him, but uh, the few that I have been seeing recently um, have been really, really good. So uh, I picked that one up. I picked up uh, Faster, and I really liked that a few weeks ago. That was at Blue uh, at Walmart. It was a DVD, but it was only uh, it was in the $5 bin, so I decided that was worth it. But um, can't go wrong. That was my haul from... Uh, Blockbuster, hope you guys can uh, check out. I know there's two stores closing in my town. This one just happened to be across from where I'm working. The other one is the store that my wife actually worked at um, when she was uh, working there. Got a uh, cappuccino blast from next door. Hopefully everybody loves and supports the, uh, the Baskin-Robbins workers of America. So, CV Breach, peace out and have fun, guys.